Welcome to Harrington School for the 2020-2021 school year. Whether you're new to Harrington or coming back as a returning student, every adult here at Harrington School is so excited to be working with you this year. Hi everyone, hi Hawks, we've really missed you. We're so excited to welcome back families. Some of you we're gonna see in person, some of you we're gonna see on Zoom calls and on screens, but either way, we're all part of the Harrington community. I'm gonna get ready to go inside, I'm gonna put my mask on, and I'll see you all soon. Ms. Daly is ready to enter the building. She's wearing her mask, and it's covering her nose and mouth. See you soon, Hawks! Your health and safety is our top priority for everyone here in the Harrington community. Therefore, things might look a little bit different at school this year. You might be learning in person with small groups of other students one week at a time, or you might be learning from home as a member of our remote learning academy where you'll work on the computer with one of Harrington's teachers. Whenever you're in the school building, it's gonna be really important that you try to maintain a six foot social distance. That means staying six feet away from other people at all times. You will also need to wear a face mask whenever you're at or around Harrington School. A proper face mask covers your nose and mouth and fits snugly on the sides of your face. Wearing a properly fitted mask is an example of caring for yourself and others. Returning students probably remember entering through the main doors or off of the playground in past school years. This year, however, each grade level will enter in their own entrance. With help from their teachers, kindergartners will enter at the back side of the building, at the single door near the seesaws and the tire swings. First graders will continue to use the main front entrance. They'll head right in the front door, take a right, and head straight to their pod. When second graders arrive at school, they'll head down the left side sidewalk to an entryway near the big pine tree. That door will bring them in towards the third grade classrooms. They'll take a right and into the second grade pod. Third graders will enter in the doorway closest to the playing fields. Off of the blacktop, they can head straight across the hall into their classrooms. Grade four students will enter off of the blacktop near the playground. They'll head straight upstairs and into their pod. Fifth grade students will also enter off of the playground. They'll head into the doors closest to the first grade pod, but instead head upstairs and into their classrooms. Our dismissal procedure will also change this year. Listen for directions from your teacher on your first day back at Harrington. There might be a day at school when you need to make a visit to Ms. Vaughn, our school nurse in the health office. Let's see if anything's changed in there this year. Oh, hi, Mr. Dever. Thanks for knocking on the door before coming in. Hold on right there. I need to put my mask on before you come any closer. I don't know if you know how to put your mask on properly, Mr. Dever, but I want you to make sure you always use your uh, ear loops to put around your ears. Now, try to not touch your mask when you're putting it on your face. So what can I do for you? I heard that things are a little bit different in the nurse's office this year, and we just wanted to take a look. Yep, you are right. Um, I'm still setting up, but as you see, I know people really know my office really well. So right away, you're gonna be able to tell that things look a little different. Um, I only have two beds over here and I have a bed over there. So when you come to see me, you're gonna knock on the door. I'm gonna ask you to come in when I'm ready with a mask. And if you're feeling, not feeling so great and have to go home, um, you might be um, able to go use my new room that I have. It's gonna be used for kids to wait while they wait for the parents to come get them. 
Um, but other than that, I am still here to put band-aids on, give you ice bags when needed, and to just say hello if you when you're walking by. The health office seems like a really safe place. And Miss Vaughn's really helpful. She also wanted to show you this new outfit that she might be wearing sometimes. Don't be surprised if you see her wearing a face shield or her white coat. Let's head back out into the hallways and check out some of these classrooms. When you arrive in your class, you may notice that desks are grouped in pairs. There will only be one student sitting at each pair of desks when you're there in the building. You'll need to keep your personal belongings right there beside you underneath that empty desk. When you are at your desk, you'll need to always be wearing your face mask and try to face forward as often as you can. Notice some of your teachers are modeling the way that you'll sit at your desk when you're working and learning in your classroom. Oh, Harry the Hawk, him too. There may be times throughout the school day when your teacher says it's okay to take off your mask. This would be during a mask break or when you're eating snack or lunch. You'd take off your mask using the ear loops and place it safely in a plastic container provided to you by your teacher. This is a really important time to practice social distancing since you won't be wearing that mask. After eating, you'll need to wash your hands with soap and water or use the hand sanitizer that's provided to you by your classroom teacher. Washing your hands and wearing your mask are two examples of Hawks behavior. We look forward to seeing each and every one of you, whether it's on the computer screen or live in person at Harrington School. Remember, we are all Hawks. Woke up this morning, I suddenly realized we're all in this together. I started smiling, cause you were smiling, and we're all in this together. I'm made of atoms, you're made of atoms, and we're all in this together. And long division. Just doesn't matter, cause we're all in this together. Yeah. I saw you walking in the city, we're all in this together. The city's changing. Changing and we're all in this together. Every 12 seconds, someone remembers that we're all in this together. In the kitchen of your rent control apartment, we're all in this together. Come on, baby, I don't mean to rush you. about jumping ship before it sinks but we are all in this together ask a scientist it's quantum physics we are all in this together and on the subway we feel like strangers but we're all in this together yeah I love you and you love her Loves him, but we are all in this together. You know, baby, there's never been protection in all the history of human connection. Come on, darling, it's 